Today, I'll show you how to set up restorative child's pose. This pose provides a gentle stretch in your back, relieve shoulder tension, can help relieve menstrual cramps, and also will help with symptoms of menopause. This pose causes the practitioner to go inward, as well as bringing high energy levels down in the body. It can provide a sense of security and also a sense of grounding. Avoid this pose if you are more than three months pregnant and always consult your doctor to make sure that this pose is appropriate for you. So now we'll set up the pose. You'll want to start with your big toes touching or as close to touching as you can get them and your knees out wide. You may want to play with the width of your knees in order to find what's most comfortable for you. Options for blankets would be underneath your knees if you have any pain there. You may also want to roll up a blanket to place under your feet that helps with tingling that may happen in this pose. So, knees out wide, big toes touching, and you'll bring your bolster vertical on the mat and in between your legs. You can also place a blanket underneath your hips if they do not reach your feet when you're in this pose to provide a little bit more support. Once you're ready to go into this pose, you'll want to slowly bring your hands towards the mat and then melt your chest into the bolster. And you can rest your forearms down on the mat. Options for head placement can be your left ear, your right ear, or hands on top of each other and forehead down. You want to make sure that your head and shoulders, as well as your hips, are all on the same plane. If your head and shoulders are lower than your hips, you'll want to add as many blankets as possible to help bring everything on the same plane. Once you are down in this pose, if you need a little bit more grounding in your hips, you can place a sandbag on your sacrum. That will help push your hips down towards your feet. Once you get set up in the pose, spend a moment here doing a body scan. Find any tension that you have and release it. Once you complete your body scan, you'll want to start with your rhythmic breathing in through the nose, out through the nose. Stay in this pose as long as it's comfortable to you. Average time, maybe three to five minutes. And if at any point you find any pain or any numbing, tingling, come out of the pose. When you're ready to come out of the pose, you'll want to place your forehead on the bolster and your palms flat down on the mat. Slowly push your chest away from the bolster Come back and sit back on your heels. Spend a moment here checking in with your body and preparing for what's next.